Hello, my viewers. Uh, have you ever wondered about why reversing valves are sometimes very difficult to replace? Uh, and I think sometimes that they're manufactured in such a way that uh, the tech uh, will option to simply replace the entire condensing unit because of the difficulty. And, you know, it wouldn't be bad, or should I say, it wouldn't be so bad to replace the reversing valve if the suction lines weren't so darn close together. And here's what I mean. All right, let's take a look at this reversing valve right here uh, that has the inch and one eighth inch suction tubing. Now, how is anybody supposed to do any brazing between here and here? There's no room, virtually. I mean, pretty much you, uh, uh, the heat is absorbed. Like, for example, if you're trying to sweat around here on the end here, the heat, a lot of the heat will be absorbed by this tube. Uh, likewise on this side. Now take a look, now look at this. See, this is exactly what I mean. There's no room in there to do a good job of brazing between here and between here. Now if you take a look at this size, I don't know what they were thinking, but somehow or another they finally got it right. This is a 7 8 reversing valve that Ranco makes. And just, uh, you see there's plenty of space in between here and here to do a good job brazing. And as you can see the close-up, see, there's, there's no problem at all brazing between uh, here and here. And this is another look of the inch and one eighth uh, showing how you know it'd be very difficult to do any brazing in there again inch and one eighth and here's the seven eighths showing see as you can see there'd be no real problem of getting a as you see there's no real problem of, of getting the torch in here in between each of these tubing connectors to do a good job brazing. Again, seven eighths. So I like to see the engineer that designed this valve uh, braze this into an air conditioning system because virtually there's very little way of doing a good job. Now, of course, I've seen people braze as well as they can and then stretch this one and this one apart, but then you're taking a risk of cracking here and here. Uh, then also, uh, I guess you could glue it. That would be one way of taking care of this problem, but uh, still, I mean, if you need to braise it, then, I mean, it's very, very, very difficult of uh, doing it without, you know, uh, having a leak here or here. So I'd like to know what you think. 